Hey guys, what's up? What's going on? In this video, I'll show you how to fix your game loop if it's stuttering so bad. Uh, although some people have good specs, but still they are facing some uh, stuttering issues um, while playing the PUBG Mobile on PC in emulator game loop, especially this video, especially for emulators you can configure any emulators after watching this video now as you can see i was stretching while landing while loading the game so that's not actually the configuration or your pc issue even the uh, game issue it's happened when you install your game in your hard disk drive and hard disk drive is older or just slow speed so that's why it's happened while loading new files so in that case you can fix it easily if you install your game in ssd or any poster a hard disk drive so this will solve your issues now let's move on the second step uh, step um, actually the best configuration according to your pc but before that if you have the low end gpu then you can also disable these options the nt aliasing and the shadow and the auto adjust graphic you can also disable it actually the auto adjust graphic makes stutter uh, while playing the games so you can just disable it okay now let's move on the main topic um, the configuration of your emulator according to your pc so before um, going further just show here i have 8 gb ram with i7 4 generation cpu and the graphic card is uh, 1060 6 gb uh, that's I think a good specs not much uh, good but it's fine now the basic knowledge about these settings if you have 8 GB RAM like me then you need to select 4 GB because your window need 3 to 4 GB RAM for you know some Windows services and background Windows so source so that's why you need to select 4 GB RAM but still your game stuttering and lagging of course uh, your game will do because your other PC setting is high but you don't have enough RAM to run game smoothly so in that case you can just decrease uh, or lower your setting I'll guide you here in this video just go into the performance in taskbar and then open resource monitor and you can see here my usage RAM usage is around 4 GB so you can always decrease it like 1 GB or 2 GB uh, by closing the Steam, Discord or Epic or any kind of background uh, services that will give you a uh, some free RAM but that's not enough for your you know high quality display high quality graphics of your uh, game now in that situation you need to um, low your uh, emulator game settings let me show you here now here you can see select all the same options but you need to select 4 gb ram suppose you have selected the game settings for 1080p because you have all good specs except ram because you have only 8 gb ram and you selected uh, for emulator is only uh, 4 gb so here you can see fhd 2k suitable for top configuration such as gtx 1060 so as you know i have 1060 but I can't play on these settings because I have 4GB and uh, 4GB is not enough for these high quality graphics so you need to go a bit lower and then graphic quality should be on automatic so it will automatically adjust and then the FPS now 60 to 90 FPS not a big difference you can select here the 60 FPS and that's it save it that's the simple setting I guess and you don't need to do anything and select all these options now here the main options open GL plus and direct X plus the basic thing is open GL plus work with your GPU and the direct X plus work with your uh, CPU if you have a good CPU then you can select the CPU if you have good GPU then you can select here the open GL plus that work with your GPU now if you don't know then leave it on automatic that's not a big issue now select the below four options and don't select any other options and just copy my settings 
uh, if still it's making uh, any stutter just uh, screen DPI should be 240 and resolution you can go a bit lower that will fix your issues now audio channel that's the main issue you can select here the direct sound direct sound uh, will respond more better than the wave out according to my experience but you can try both if you are going with my settings then I'm highly recommending go with the direct sound because uh, I have a lot of experience with these settings so that's why I'm recommending the direct X uh, sorry direct wave now here uh, someone told me they use the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra but I don't think so it's work but you can try these settings these settings are perfect for me you can also try these settings and just let me know your experience after these settings and this configuration and i know i'm kind of bad with english but i'm trying for you if you didn't understand anything just let me know in the comment section the last thing is just click on windows icon search for graphic drivers and add your emulator over here once you add it just click on the option select high performance and save it actually uh, this will uh, boost up your gpu source on uh, emulator so this is for today i hope you like this video if you have any question just let me know in the comment section and yeah i have a gaming channel on a link is gonna be in the description just go ahead check it out uh, mostly i'm playing valorant right now and you will enjoy the gameplay mostly i'm making montages but uh, as soon as possible i'll start streaming i'm just waiting for response if some pupils like to watch live streams on my channel then definitely i'll do uh, that for you till then just take yourself love is bye bye